sir? Nothing? Everything's fine. Just, uh, one of the claptrap units tried to French kiss the light socket, sir. Need I remind you that you are there to observe Pandora, nothing more. If you incur any damages to the Helios space station, I will personally... Ah, oh, sorry, sir, we're losing connection. I can't... Uh, sorry. Asshole. What? I called you an asshole because I thought I'd hung up. Okay, all good. My bad. We will speak again, John. There's Elpis. That friggin' jamming signal is somewhere down on that cracked rock messing up all the cool security stuff up here. I found help! Oh, we're getting shot by a fucking Son of a tate! Why the hell are you attacking us, you dick? I want the station and I want to save the universe. The hell is that supposed to be? Doll forces have breached the station. Run! Run faster, you're supposed to be trying to get the hell out of here. Walk like you got a load. So, what are we doing? Some. Basically, is that safe? I don't know. Claptrap, start boot up sequence. Claptrap, start boot up sequence. Claptrap, start boot up sequence. Is he stuck? Money, revenge, that said, whoever needed a reason out here. Got some help for ya! Oh, there's, a, there's a weapon chest up over here. I just found it. I like jacket back for
put my ability in at level one. Get out there, Wolf! <laughs> Over there. Uh, let's go. This is kind of exciting. Yeah. Our story just began with us getting off a bus. This sounds all explosive and <laughs> stuff. Stop complimenting the prisoner. We can get in the moonshot up there. Let me get the elevator. Resequencing combat protocol! Jamming the elevator up there. Figure something out. Alright, good idea. Uh, let me work the loading truck. Woohoo! Uh, in your face! Ow. That was crazy. That hurt a lot. <laughs> Alright, you get to the moonshot cylinder and we'll ride it up. <laughs> Oh, we have Watch to go your steps. That'll be a hell of a fall. I will do my best to not fall to my death. <laughs> Let's get moving. Hold on, I'm gonna spin the cylinder. You have a wheel. Can I get up there. Free up the elevator so I can join you. Ow. Hey man! Yeah, she got wedged in tight. Eh, no big deal though, they can't feel pain. Just bash them out of there. Oh, these loaders bum me out. It's no wonder Dahl took us over so easily. I need more soldiers. Badasses. Like you. Oh. Jack's looking at me weird. We made it! We just gotta get into a moonshot. A crate of Hyperion shall not have to this asshole! That's twice you've saved my life. Uh, now we just gotta... Oh, for what? The, the auto shot controls are damaged! Someone's gotta stay back and launch the pods manually. Uh, I'd suggest Wilhelm, but I need you there on Elpis cracking skulls. What was that? I wasn't listening. All right, new plan. I'll stay behind. I need you down on the moon. You gotta find that jamming signal and shut it down. Otherwise, we'll never get control of the moon base and we can kiss that vault goodbye. You really gonna stay? I better get paid if you bite it. Now you saved my life a couple of times, I'm repaying the favor. Besides, I'm a hero, baby. Self-sacrifice is part of the job. Oh, good, a health machine. I had one put in here after a worker had an accident and, uh, lost his torso. Better heal up before your trip down to the moon. <laughs> Might want to grab some ammo, too. Supplies over here. We need to get a moonshot container up here. Normally, we'd load some supplies, but this time, you're the car. This container ought to do the trick. So the container's all ready. Just cool. I'm closing the container. Watch your limbs. Loading you into the delivery chamber. This is gonna be loud. It's slightly awesome. Talk to me, Jack. You handsome Jack, the guy who murdered my boyfriend, stayed behind while he escaped. Like hell. 
Whether his decision was heroic or purely strategic, I can't say. But if Jack hadn't stayed behind to reject the pod, I might well have died on Helios. <laughs> Your story is making handsome Jack kind of sympathetic. I hate it. All right, we're ready to fire. Whenever you're ready, I'll shoot you to Concordia. It's the biggest town on Elpis. I know someone there who can help you find that jamming signal. Looks like we're going for it. We got this. Oh, God. There he is! Open fire! Oh, crap. You're not okay. The second you open this door, all the oxygen is going to vent and all the non-robots in there are going to suffocate. It'll hurt a lot and your eyes will pop like grapes when the pressure differential gets too harsh. So, Sweet. here's my plan. When you're ready, open the door and follow me to my oxygen bubble. Sound good? Don't answer. Conserve your oxygen. Holy crap. Here, I'll turn on this air dome generator so you can get a breather. Oh, you're so lucky. Be embarrassing if you died now. Go, 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 go. What the hell are we? Where are we going? Oh my God. What are you doing? <laughs> I'm dying here. Woman. Everybody good? Nice to meet ya. I'm Janie Springs, junk dealer. Who are you? I am an experimental prototype known as FR4G. Cool. So what are you doing here? There's a signal somewhere on the moon that is jamming Helios station's defenses. To return to Helios, we need to destroy the jamming signal. A jamming signal? Haven't noticed anything like that. You might want to get to Concordia, a little city run by a fella called the Merif. Got to be somebody there who can help you. You'll need an O2 kit, Oz kits we call them, to survive the journey though. I've got some broken ones stashed nearby, but I can repair them for you. Even if you ain't the breathing type, you'll be glad you've got an Oz kit. Head to these coordinates and clear the place out. Let's go do business. Oh. 